بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم السلام عليكم uh, dear guests uh, um, as part of Crescent Ratings Halal Dining Asian Forum it's an honor and a pleasure to welcome you to what I think is going to be very interesting um, part of their event because we have a chance to spend more time with one speaker in an area that's extremely important for the purposes of uh, the B40, for the purposes of economic development, for the purposes of countries showcasing what is espousing in the area of uh, financial inclusion. Mm -hmm. um, our speaker, um, who I will allow him to uh, talk about himself and his company uh, before we get into what we're going to talk about, makes more sense because he has done some remarkable things. And I think it's better that he talk about it um, than myself. Um, he, he is from Linkaja and his uh, name is brother with, with Jayanto. My apologies if I got it incorrect. Um, my dear brother, if you could just share with us uh, in a minute uh, at a high level of the firm, um, how you started it, uh, the progress, what you're doing, and then uh, the vision ahead, and then we'll get into those points. Hi, Assalamualaikum everyone. Uh, my name is Wijayanto, uh, the Chief Operating Officer of Link Aja. Uh, Link Aja is Imani and e wallet uh, service provider initiated by Indonesian SOEs. And as of today, we have about uh, 79 million uh, registered users, while uh, the 5 million of those are Link Aja Sharia in your introductory remarks the number 79 million and the number 5 million that that's 70, remarkable. 79 yeah, 79. yeah 79 million and 5 million those are remarkable numbers and mm -hmm. those are numbers that i want us to um, get into because at the end of the mm -hmm. day you know you've got a lot the mission and the vision and all these philosophies but at the mm -hmm. end of the day it's those who are interested in what you're doing, they'll sign up, then they'll utilize. And yeah. that's where the value add is. So let's let's talk about that 79 million first, and then we'll talk about the Shari and the 5 million. Tell us, first of all, how you got to that number. Is this something that was linear, then it exploded uh, yeah. exponentially? And what was the cause of that? And tell us about the retention rate and loyalty. Mm -hmm. We started our journey in uh, 2019. As of today, we have about uh, 79 million registered users across Indonesia, uh, where we focus on daily uh, use cases, uh, such as airtime, electricity bills, water bills, phone bills, and transportation use case, instead of a uh, lifestyle use case. I think uh, behind the rapid growth of Link Aja, it is uh, the fact that uh, we are supported by a strong network of Indonesian SOEs and leading technology companies in Southeast Asia, uh, uh, such as uh, Grab and Gojek as our shareholders. By leveraging our ecosystem, we catalyze the digitalization of many sectors uh, to facilitate uh, access toward financial services while specifically uh, targeting uh, tier two and tier three cities, which 79% uh, of the user penetration come uh, from this area, uh, to accelerate financial inclusion in Indonesia using our core uh, differentiation. Uh, we're focusing on the aspirant uh, target audience where uh, the level of FinTech exposure and awareness are not as high as in uh, major cities. Uh, we believe that by uh, tapping into this group of target audience, Link Aja will be able to create uh, a real uh, social impact uh, leading up to uh, financial inclusivity. While creating a seamless user experience at the top, uh, Link Aja also worked uh, closely with respected uh, uh, stakeholders in different uh, cities. Uh, throughout the country by highlighting and uh, developing the digital transaction ecosystem in the area uh, potential uh, use cases. I want to know, and mm -hmm. I think the viewers here want to know your secret sauce uh, mm -hmm. in how you got to where you are. So 
there's something that you are mm -hmm. obviously addressing on the mm -hmm. needs of uh, a person, everyday needs. Mm -hmm. There's friction, whether it's cost, whether it's accessibility, you've addressed that. Mm -hmm. If you yes. could share with us, what are the top five things mm -hmm. that your average user likes about you and then they become your ambassadors? And so your customer acquisition costs become very low. So if you could share mm -hmm. with us the five top things that your users love about uh, your platform. Some top things that we can share about our platform uh, that uh, differentiate us uh, in the, uh, from, from the uh, user's perspective. First, a survey in 2021 run by Nielsen stated that uh, customer perception about LinkAja are LinkAja has the most complete payment method, easy to use, practical, uh, trustworthy, and safe. Second, uh, LinkAja is the only payment method that can be used uh, for both Gojek and Grab. Uh, those are uh, quite uh, popular in Indonesia. Third, the third one, there is a unique difference uh, between it comes to awareness uh, of Link Aja. Awareness in tier, uh, tier one comes, uh, comes from YouTube, uh, Instagram, online ads, and TikTok, where in uh, tier two and tier three cities come from a small cafe, mall, and supermarket. The fourth one, Link Aja is the first and the largest e-wallet Sharia in Indonesia and Southeast Asia that provide Sharia based use cases. Uh, for example, uh, Jiswaf, Zakat, Infaq, Sodakoh, Wakaf, and also uh, Sharia based investment on top of uh, conventional uh, customers app uh, use cases. The fifth uh, one, is that uh, Link Aja Sharia is uh, doing very well in Aceh with essential use cases uh, in traditional market. You're talking about tier two and tier three cities. Uh, financial literacy is probably mm -hmm. low. So there's efforts done on education and awareness. Yeah. Can you share with us um, the process of targeting a particular village or sets of village, then yeah. how you go about uh, uh, creating an awareness and education and yes. what's the feedback that you've learned in terms of uh, becoming more focused on uh, the uh, educational tools. As our target market is uh, mass aspirant and uh, MSME, education on digital and financial literacy plays a very important role uh, so people will accept the adoption of the wallet uh, in terms of uh, how they can benefit from it and uh, the advantage uh, provided by being e wallet enabled. As many educational tools and methods are there, we learned that three things drive the adoption of uh, digital payments. The first one is strong collaboration. LinkAja has the advantages as a, a financial technology that is supported by a prominent SOEs in Indonesia and Southeast Asia Deca uh, which enable us to collaborate with our shareholders and other SOE as well as uh, communities uh, such as uh, Muslimat NU in Indonesia to bring awareness and educate the people. The second one, uh, relationship with, with regulators and uh, local government. While we support the government to implement ETPD, or local government transaction electronification, we educate uh, the, loca the local community as well. The third one, uh, I think, uh, yeah, we have to admit that this uh, pandemic has forced uh, digital acceleration and uh, digital uh, adoption by the market. I think that at one level that becomes uh, a government function and you're helping the government out with respect to that. And I think that's probably appreciated by yeah. the officials. And, and that's a wonderful thing uh, yeah. that you're doing um, as, as, as part of giving uh, of, of what your uh, company is about. So many congratulations to you and the senior leadership in taking that approach. 
uh, I want to sort of switch gears and talk about mm -hmm. the, the Sharia customer base. You mentioned mm -hmm. 5 million. 5 million. Uh, can you share with us what things they are specifically looking for? Uh, are they more difficult to convert into a customer? Or yeah. are, they, are they the same level of effort required compared to a non-Sharia customer? Yeah, based on our internal surface, uh, Link Aja Sharia users are looking for serenity and security during their uh, transaction. Link Aja Sharia is the first and a leading Sharia electronic money in Indonesia to obtain a Sharia compliance certificate issued by uh, in Indonesian Ulama Council. M M yeah. As per November uh, 2021, we have uh, more than uh, 5 million registered users. Uh, yeah, and this number uh, still keep growing. Yeah, increase 234% uh, compared to the data at the end of uh, December 2020. Link Aja Sharia's main target market is a uh, customer who are concerned about uh, Sharia compliance, halal. Furthermore, furthermore uh, we offer our customers an electronic money that has excellent uh, value such as uh, complete features, safe, easy, and uh, seamless uh, digital payment and uh, can be used both in uh, Link Aja regular and also uh, Sharia features. Obviously, um, that 5 million number is going to grow uh, yeah. because of um, the natural pull for those type of services. I assume that the demand by the Sharia customer service uh, uh, is for regular everyday things and not a lifestyle issue. Is that right? Yeah, yeah correct. correct. Now, um, uh, how are you um, looking at the women market, women empowerment? Mm. Women are often an important contributor on mm. the budget of a family and all this other stuff. So as part of your education, as part of your continuous ongoing education, as part of focus group studies, if you could share with our viewers um, uh, the insights that you've learned in terms of working with uh, uh, women who are your customers. Mm. Women are a decision maker when it comes to financial decision. However, according to women's uh, worldbanking.org, 48% or about uh, 47 million of women in Indonesia remain, remain unbanked and 18 million of women have accounts that have not been used in the last uh, 12 months. Link Aja as well as uh, Link Aja Sharia are committed to empower women and women printers yeah, through digital payments with uh, the first one, uh, reducing uh, barriers. Yeah. Digital payment give women better access to the marketplace, yeah, lowering this ba uh, these uh, barriers uh, to mobility. The second one, access to capital. Digital payments give access to capital for women entrepreneurs to support uh, income generation. The third one uh, enable money transfer, yeah? uh, digital payment access to basic saving, uh, basic saving, e-money accounts uh, for wage or uh, remittance uh, services. The last one, uh, privacy. Electronic payment ensure uh, women's money is private and secure, making it uh, less likely that uh, family members or others, uh, yeah, will demand. A, a portion of a cash. Um, the fact that you're looking at it um, is, is 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 a great part of that inclusion story that you were talking about for the before. yeah yeah yeah. So that's that's good. Um, I'd, I'd like to also um, talk about um, your um, vision five years and ten years ahead because obviously mm -hmm. you have um, a bigger vision as you get more customers that 79 million becomes 120 million inshallah yeah. in a few years and that 5 million becomes 25 million. What do you think will propel the growth? Is it based upon your products and services being the most competitive and easiest to use or is it going to be something else? Yeah. Well, 
Uh, we strive to uh, drive financial and economic inclusion to accelerate Indonesian Indonesia's uh, national economic growth. We continuously develop uh, ecosystem, uh, payment, and financial service platform for around uh, 170 million Indonesian mass micro and uh, aspirant segment. 79% of our user penetration is in uh, tier two and tier three uh, cities. Therefore, uh, we do realize that our technology uh, has to be able to support our purpose. And to do that, uh, we have to provide uh, services that are easy to use and uh, safe. That's why uh, we have implemented uh, necessary measurement to ensure that our platform is safe to use uh, based on the ISO uh, standard to 2001. 2013, yeah. Are there plans for the investing side, both conventional investing and Sharia compliant investing in, in, in the near future? Oh, yes. Uh, we already support the investment product for both uh, conventional and uh, Sharia compliance through cooperation and collaboration with other fintech, such as Investry, uh, Coinworks, BB and etc. Um, last question. Uh, time went by very fast uh, because mm -hmm. I think we had a, a good and meaningful conversation. And someone like me who did know about um, your wonderful company and uh, mm -hmm. the wonderful work it's doing, mm -hmm. obviously, I've become uh, converted, if you will, to follow mm -hmm. your company on social media. So um, yes. that's, that's wonderful. What uh, what are the ambitions for uh, Linkage mm -hmm. beyond uh, Indonesia? Is there ambitions for um, Malaysia? Is there ambitions to South Asia, India, Pakistan, mm -hmm. so on and so forth? Uh, or is, is that too early to talk about those things now? Yeah. We believe that um, there is no dream that is too big. So yes, we have the ambition to drive uh, Linkage beyond uh, Indonesia. We have integrated uh, payment uh, infrastructure with PPRO, global provider uh, regulated in the UK, which enable international payment companies and their merchant to cater uh, Indonesian preferred uh, payment methods. And we also uh, supporting the central bank, uh, Bank of Indonesia in industrial sandbox with implementation of cross-border uh, QR Indonesian standard in Southeast Asia country. Uh, and it is a potential extended to support Hajj and Umbro uh, services. Yes, and we're uh, cooking other things that, and we do hope that in the near future, we'll, we will be able to deliver our purpose and uh, expand beyond the national uh, champion uh, FinTech uh, platform. Thank you. Um, this is all remarkable. It's very exciting uh, uh, for Linkage, its uh, staff and its customers in terms of the growth. I think uh, this is a truly disruptive uh, uh, opportunity that you've taken advantage of it and are become more mission driven as you were talking about. It's about uh, inclusion and education. These are mm -hmm. wonderful things. And it's part of a bigger story, which is on impact. So I, I think uh, impact, sustainability, inclusion, these mm -hmm. are wonderful things. And uh, I think myself and others who have heard you will monitor and continue to monitor and wish you well uh, going forward. Uh, my dear brother, Thank you very, very much for your time, for your insights, and I look forward to uh, our continued conversations in the future. Yeah. Thank you.